world and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. My name is Kelthos and in the last episode we had finished talking to that Yes Man robot and he told us that the Platinum chip has a bunch of data on it that can help us take over New Vegas if we wanted to or we can give it to Mr. House and he will take over New Vegas and uh, he asked us if we did take over New Vegas to decide what to do with all the tribes so we have to go meet all the tri different tribes and see what we think of them and uh, whether we think they should be kicked out of the Vegas Strip if they're in the Strip or if they're out of the Strip to see if they needed to be wiped out or whatever. I don't know if I want to take over the Strip because I don't know if I want to kill Mr. How Mr. House but I kind of that wouldn't feel bad if I did because I kind of like the idea of being in control of the strip and deciding who gets to stay and who gets to go and being in control of the of whether or not the other places around here tribes around here in the wasteland get to live or not and Mr. House is just a computer now instead of a, a person so I wouldn't feel as bad but we'll have to see so in this episode, we're going to finish hey. exploring the strip and everything, and then continue on from there. So here we go. I would go in there, but I don't want to piss everybody off. How about I save it first, and then try to go in here. Did I get caught? You've lost karma. Okay. Hmm. Hello? The torch in the police idea. Brilliant, man. Sure. I lost karma for going in here, but I wanna know what I wanted to know what was down here. So far it's nothing suspicious. They were just torch torching you. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Water main burst upstairs. They sent me down to survey the damage. Curse it all. Your timing couldn't be more atrocious. Just make it quick, all right? But yeah, I uh, wanted to see what was up down here. And so far, it's not suspicious. They were just torching meat, and it looked like Brahmin meat, so it wasn't that bad. <laughs> Elevator to Ultralux Kitchen. We'll just see what is here. Pre-war book. Hmm. Ooh. This is just a restroom, I think. I will lose karma if I steal from that, so I don't want to. I mean, I do want to, but I'm not going to because I don't want to lose karma. Hmm. This kitchen is considerably less kept up than the rest of the place has been. Call head waiter? No. Squirrel on a stick. Okay. Pantry access terminal. Oh. Hmm. I don't want to steal anything. Like I said. Freezer access terminal. Requires key. Okay, where can I get a key? Hmm. I don't know. Okay, can't go in there. Well, I can, but there's nothing in there. Continue this way, I suppose. And that goes back up. Okay, so did I go everywhere down here? No, there's still more. Somewhere. This way. Hmm. Kitchen. White glove members only section. Hmm. 
what's in here. Let's uh, quick save it again and go in. What the? You like that? Oh shit! You like that? Had enough? Can't run from me. Hmm. Why are they all trying to attack me? I don't understand. You like that? Just because I went in the members only section? Had enough? No, I haven't. Come on! Hmm. I'm just trying to. Oops. Yeah, let's reload. I don't want to piss everybody off. Okay, after several times of going back in there and checking it out, I haven't saw anything suspicious in there either. So, sadly, I'm going to have to go, I think. Well, I was going to leave, but then I. Uh, re uh, after I got out of this. Gormon place, there was a bathhouse across, so I'm gonna check it out. Hey. I said hey. Somebody did. Steam room. Hmm. What is this? Back where we were. No, that's the hotel rooms. Never mind. Out of order. Hmm. There's nobody in here to talk to, Did so let's just leave. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to go to the rooms over here. Okay, I'm back. I uh, cut that out because there wasn't anything in there to look at. Just empty rooms and people sleeping that were travelers that weren't anybody to talk to. So, Chauncey, hello. Good day. Why is everyone around here dressed up and wearing masks? Those are all members of the White Glove Society. Our founder Marjorie gave us all a dress code. There's only one rule to it. In her words, we must dress in such a way that no one can be said to have dressed better than us. As for the masks, I'm not allowed to tell you. We're sworn to secrecy. Actually, that's not true. That's just what we're supposed to say. Hmm. I think Marjorie likes them for the mystery they create, and the way they make it clear that we're different from everyone else. I see. But you didn't hear that from me. Uh, where's your mask? Mm, must have forgotten to put it on. How embarrassing. Hmm. Goodbye. Farewell. Something is up, but I'm not able to deduce it. My sus meters are going off. I don't know. Let's just leave. Believe we've explored all we can here. How do you fare? Okay, so we've been casino, blah blah blah, the tops. That goes back to the way we came. So we want to go this way then, right? Please do not stand in the fountains. Okay, I wasn't planning to, but okay. Now, where's this go? Got a whole bunch of weapons back. That's good. What is this place? Vault 21 gift shop. It's a little rinky dink shop. Hello. Hello. How come you won't talk to me? Hi, Hi, I'm Sarah, Sarah Weintraub. Welcome to the finest vault hotel in the whole world. Okay, uh, I'm looking for Carlitos. Do you know him? Carlitos, huh? Yeah, I do. Try the diner. 
Don't start to trouble you here. I won't. Still got stuff to talk to you about. Come back. Hey. Good to see you again. Uh, what kinds of things do you sell in this gift shop? I have all sorts of things. Vault souvenirs, vault wares, vault machines, vault mementos, and vault suits. And, well, lots of other vault things, too. Hmm, vault gear. Swell. Can you show me what you got? Actually, let me ask about something else. Okay. Um, a vault hotel. Was it like this before the war? No, silly. Of course it wasn't always a hotel. <clears throat> I grew up in it. I love it. My favorite place in the world. Not that I know much of the world. I never left this place, come to think of it. But it is the most special vault ever. Uh, what is so special about My it? My vault is pure New Vegas. Everyone has a chance, and Lady Luck smiles if you play your odds right. Okay, it was like that before we had to leave. Vault 21 had very smart ways to help people get along. All arguments and fights got solved through gambling. I'll give you a quick tour of my home. Oh yeah, if you like. Uh, I still have some questions first. Alright, what would you like? Uh, you have never actually left this place? Sure I have. I made the scene in the strip. It's just that I really like it here. Vault 21 is a kick. I see. Um... I grew up in it. I love it. My Dang it. Well, I can't do that. Anyway, uh, I had some other questions for you. I would like to hear again about the items you sell here. I would like to ask you some questions. Alright. Uh, you said that Vault 21 wasn't always a hotel. Oh, silly. Of course it wasn't always a hotel. What does Mr. House have to do with it? Mr. House has everything to do with Vault 21. He tried to get us out before he filled it with concrete. I almost went eight. So we convinced him. Okay, Sheldon and I, right? We convinced him to leave the top level mostly intact. Why did he fill the vault? I don't know. Maybe he didn't want anybody sneaking around down there. Weird. My vault runs deep and wide. It's filled with corridors and rooms that go far. What gives him the right to screw us with the royal shaft anyway? So he saved New Vegas. Woohoo! Now scram and let us go on with our lives. Sheesh. Exactly. <laughs> uh, I would like to know other things about you in this hotel. I see. Okay, your move. Uh, you run this place then? Yeah, and you gotta dig what I did with it. Looking as good as it should? Almost. Do you miss the good old days? It was bustling with activity. We all knew each other so well. You see, the vault kept us all even. Hmm. It's all symmetry and windows down there. We solved Weird. any quarrels through gambling. Lady Luck cast no eyeballs, you know? So, nobody shafted anyone else. Yeah, I miss those days. Uh, do you know Doc Mitchell? Mitch? You mean Molebutt? I hadn't thought about that name in a long time. I was just a child and he had a big mole in his rear bumper. You understand kids and all that. Everyone knows about each other in a vault. There's no other way. So he grew up there I too? Mo I mean, Mitch is doing well. He's doing fine from what I know. Uh, do you get a lot of business sure. here? Sure. The place is packed. Usually. We get loads of NCR cubes these days. A stray cubes. Brahmin Baron once in a while. And recently circle couples shining big rocks on their fingers. Uh, do you miss the old days in the vault? I already asked you that. Okay, um... Uh, do you... Well, how do I get... Uh, sorry, I'm trying to figure this out. I'd like to hear again what the items you sell here. Yeah. I have all sorts of things. Vault souvenirs, vault... Okay. Uh, goodbye. Talk Good to, to you, see again. you again. I'm trying to ask her what I asked her before that made her want to give me the tour. So hang on one second. I'll give you a quick tour of my home. Oh yeah. There we go. I got if it. If you like. Sure. Radio, Daddyo. Let's do it. Sure. Let's do it. All right. Please follow me. We'll head into the vault right away. This bunker protects the entrance to the vault. Solid stone outside and thick steel on the inside. Morning. Well, you gonna go? 
acted like she didn't even know I was there. Weird. <laughs> Come on. You're a slow walker. Do you have anything to say about the vault? Good to see you again. Hello? What is going on? Okay. Above us, there's a control center for this level of the vault's life support systems, electric grid, radioactive shields, and all that jazz. Don't get lost. My vault has many corridors and rooms, although it is no longer symmetrical after Mr. House threw us out. Who would have thought a place like this would exist? You turned around? Wish I, I don't know who's saying that, but no, I'm not. Come on. Wish I could have seen what's inside the 38. This is the main game hall. Here we settled the big disputes among the vault's levels. Chosen representatives gambled against each other here. The winner <clears throat> earned the right to settle the dispute as wished by the collective. I see. We used to have such parties in this diner. Come on. A bit Time to get later, but well stirred up lately. It. Almost out of caps. I'm gonna wait till she's done with the tour, and then I'm gonna go in there and try to find Cordelito. <laughs> this hall leads Watch to our Vegas guest rooms. Vegas night, you can use like the first room else. on our left, but no snooping next door. That's my room. Always was. Vegas hmm. at night is like nothing else. Down there is the game room. Maybe Each I'll check out her room one. too because she doesn't but want the me other to. Is filled with concrete now. Okay, that wraps it up. I'll see you soon. Okay, that was a hey. quick tour. She said I can use the one on the left. This one. Hmm. I assume not because I. I don't know. I'm trying to figure it out. Oops. You were in my way. Watch your caps. They go quick. This is very, very windy. Open door. I don't know where I'm going here. Oh, that's the part that got sealed up. Okay. Well, I think... That's all we can do here. I'm going to go to the diner and talk and see if I can find Carlito because she said he's in there and that she knows him. So if that's around? the case, then maybe we can find him for that woman. Uh, she showed us where the diner was when she was showing us the rooms. Hello. The diner... Hang on while I figure out where the fuck the diner is. Found it. Right here. I was in the wrong room. Anyway, Carlito, are you here? Yes, there you are. Hey, do you mind? I'm trying to drink myself to the ground right here. Scram. Uh, I'm here on Johanna's back. What did you say? I mean, I mean Joanna. No, Johanna. Please, tell me. Is she alright? When did you see her? What did she have to say? I just saw her. She didn't know if you were still alive. And then she has to know. I'm ready to help her escape once and for all. Am I even scared of Kachino and all those fuckers? Joanna and I are dead anyway if we don't get the hell out of here. Yeah, you are. Uh, why don't you get her out of Gamora? What, you think I can just waltz in there and take her away? She's there, doll, now, okay? Besides, I step in Gamora and I'm as good as dead, you hear? You don't just leave the emeritus unless it's in a body bag. Oh, there's a timer. Uh, I'll let her know. I'll try, but not for free. First, let me ask you some questions. Questions can wait. Joanna can't. Okay, I'll let her know that you'll help. Deal. Come back with news soon, you hear? Uh, I'll do what I can. Will you remember... Will you answer my questions now? All right. About what do you want to know? 
Well, in the next episode, we will ask him some questions and figure out what he knows. Uh, I want to thank you all for watching, and if you like what you see, I suggest you subscribe to my channel so you can see the new videos I post every single day. And if you really like the videos, I'd really like it if you could leave a thumbs up and a comment. That way I could have some interaction on my channel and know that people are actually watching and actually care. And if you want to know when I post my videos, exactly when I post them, the best way to do that is to turn on your notifications as well. Talk to you all later. Bye-bye.